going on YouTube? It is your boy Hacker Triple 7. Now in today's video, we will be learning how to create our own custom widgets using Custom Widget Maker. Now you could easily find this application on the Google Play Store. It has this icon and I'll hop on the Play Store real quick and show you guys this application. Okay, so it is the first one. Now, this is the free version. You could also download the pro version. Now, this application allows you to create your own custom widgets on your home screen. And as you can see, it has quite a comprehensive description right here. You could customize the colors and basically everything. So how to use this? So first you need to install this application and click on open and here is an instruction add a widget to start. So you currently have no custom widget on screen. Please add one first by long pressing an empty area on the home screen and select add widget then pick KWGT from the list. If the launcher does not list any widget please reboot once. Okay so as you can see the information as to what you should do is right here so let me go to my home screen so i am on i am on my home screen so the instruction is to long press and select widgets as you can see widgets is here at the bottom of the screen so you click on the widget icon so you need to search for or scroll down until you see kwgt so let's continue to scroll and as you can see it's right here and there are quite a bit of widgets which I can create. I could create a KWGT widget which is 1x1, one 2x2, by 4x1, one, 4x2, two by 2x4, two, four by 4x4 four by two, two by four, four by four, and a KWGT action which is basically an action which would press the widget to launch an application or to carry out a specific task on your device. So I'm going to select the 2x2 two or touch and hold to pick the widget and drag it to the home screen okay so the next step as you can see i drag the the two by two widget to the home screen and the next step would be to click to set up or long press to resize so i'm going to simply click on this area which i drag the widget and as you can see this is quite a detailed specifics which i could use to customize my widget so i could select any one of these to which I wanted to use for my widget. So let me see which one I'll be doing. Okay, let's say we want to do this circular battery. So I'm going to select that one. And as you can see, you have basically the option or the free will to create or customize this in any way you want. The colors, the font, the text size, and all of that. So let's say the background color well i'm going to leave that alone the items so for the circle as you can see that is the that is identified as the progress the circle um you could select the angle you can select the width of this circle the height and so on the paint which would basically the color uh let me see the progress color and then you could change that color as you can see I changed it to a stroke so and I could change the width of this stroke And as you can see, I am basically selecting the I'm basically selecting the, the stroke and adjusting the color. And you have the effects if you want to add texture to this, if you want to add drop shadows, the position as to where the circle would be, you could um, basically set it slant. 
there are quite a bit of features here i'm not sure why it's not allowing me to change the color for some reason it's not allowing me to change this color right here so let me go back now this is basically the the circle which the battery has been used the white part of the circle and this is the progress part of the circle i could set it to be triangle oval basically various elements which i could select stroke and fill and so on now the color is not allowing me to change it Usually I would simply click on the color and I would have the option to pick from a color spectrum the various colors which I want to select. But maybe it works different on your device or maybe it's for this particular widget. As you can see, it is looking quite beautiful on my home screen right here. And if I had reduced the size, then you would see the full circle. Now that is basically a demonstration as to do the basic with this application i could try another one let me give another one a quick try for this i'm going to use the same two by two drag it to this home screen and click on it to set up now we could select various uh let me see i'm going to use a simple one um, the background is solid and as you can see uh, this is what I wanted to see for the first one the option to select or change the color it was not presented with the first okay click on save right there the first um, what I was saying was that the first widget did not give me the the option to change the the background color Now, as you can see, we have a custom widget on our home screen and you could simply resize this, drag it down to resize, which is quite unique. Normally, you would not be able to resize widgets on your home screen that small. So this is quite cool. Um, custom widget maker, you could feel free to give it a try. I'll leave it in the description. Now, this is not a full tutorial on this application. Um, if you want me to do a full tutorial please let me know i'll do some more research on this application because i'm not a pro at it but i'm a pro at editing so i could basically take a few hours and mess around with this application and see all the features what it has to offer and how to use it to fully customize any widget of your choice so let me know if you want me to do that or i believe this is because i'm using the free version i am limited to certain things maybe that's the case so i'll check that out and i'll get back to you on that so basically this is just a simple demonstration of how to use kwgt to create a simple widget which you would not normally get on your android device and remember the launcher which you have running would have to um have the functionality of you adding widgets to your home screen so that is basically it for this video a look into kwgt which is custom widgets for your android devices so thank you guys for watching if you found this video useful please let me know in the comments below hacker triple seven out